So in the previous video I showed you how to make the speeded gecko and using the same process we're going to make beaded ladybugs. You need one meter fishing line, three colors, any colors you want, it can be all the same, it can be different, and black beads. Okay. So on your fishing line take one end and one end. Now you're going to take five black seed beads. Okay, and you're going to have two just off to the side. Okay. Now you're going to pass through the, la the last three that you put on there. I'm challenged. Okay. Just like you did for the gecko. I don't know if you can see that. See how it's coming out both ends? Okay. Now grab the two ends and pull. And I should have that in the middle. Now for the next row, you're going to do three black seed beads. You're going to take the other side and go through. Pull that down. Now you want four seed beads. Pass through. It's the same technique as the gecko. Now, you're going to want another set of four black beads. Okay. Now pick a color to start with. Whatever one you want. I'm just going to... The light one first. Okay. Now you want two of your color, one black, and then two of your color. And then pull that down. Okay, now going to want to twist every now and then. Just coax it into the right spot and then pull tight. You can't see it, but it does zigzag a bit. Five pink beads. Now you want, if you can see that, there you go, six beads alternating, so one, 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 one. You want six with your colors on either end. These are going to make your dots. Next, you need six pink beads. Why can't I do this? There we go. Six pink beads. So next, you need four pink, one black, four pink. Next you need seven pink beads. Ok, 
Okay, now you need one pink, one black, two pink, one black, two pink, one black, one pink. There is nine in total. Seven pink beads. Four pink, one black, four pink. Six pink. One pink, one black, one pink, one black, one pink. Oh, missed one. Five pink beads. Two pink, one black, two pink. Three pink. And there is your completed ladybug. Now you can stop at this point or you continue on and keep adding ladybugs to the length that you want. So I'm going to switch out this one for the medium. And to add another ladybug, you just get the head going. So, so three black beads like we did before. Another row of three. Now you're going to do two rows of four. So this is one. Now once you got this far, just follow the color pattern like you did before. So here's my finished one. I chose to do three pinks and they kind of look a little, kind of gives it an ombre effect because I went from light to dark. So now to finish it off, you're going to need to make a loop. You can do it in any color, any size you want doesn't matter. So I chose to do just three black, one pink, three black, one pink, and then three black. And then on this side I have an extra pink to finish the pattern off once I tie it together. So all you're going to do is tie it in a knot. So tie it. Don't let it curl though. The beads. 
There we go. So just tie it tight. Maybe put a couple knots in there. So I don't know if you can see it, but there is a knot there. Now take one end. and put it back through a couple beads so it kind of comes down and out. Now do the other side to this one this way. So flip it over that's coming out. Just go back through a couple more. Doesn't matter. Just pull it tight. There you go. Get a pair of scissors. There you go. You're done. You could add you could add keychain. You could add this is one of those geckos, but you could add a zipper and then attach it to your your jacket, your backpack, anything.